Okay, so welcome back once again to Tales of Zestirion! Here we are in the Trial of Earth, chasing down a Minotaurus to slay him. I'm sure he really wants to be caught by us if we're going to kill him. Looks like we can't go that way, so we are on a linear path. Bring it on, slime man. I assume this is some kind of earth-winded, earth-elemental slime. We eat wind, apparently, so there you go. The more you know. Yeah, but they're not that strong, though, are they? They're really not that strong. Yeah, they're really kind of weak, actually. In fact, they don't really do an awful lot of anything. They honestly don't have much health. I guess we fought several times out. We fought blue ones anyway. Did we fight other types? Actually, I think this is the first slime we've seen since the blue ones. So we've seen water slimes and we've seen earth slimes. Fantastic. Sonic Thrust. Pretty cool. Well, I had a lot of practice with Miklia. I did. That that's true. We've we've heard that many times. There is the Minotaurus. I assume he's not going to fight us because that would be pretty easy. Do we actually have a wind spell? Yes, we do. Raging Wait Rains. Higher Art of Crimson Edge, apparently. Well, there you go. So we may as well use Crimson Edge so we can use the next one. That works. That works for me. If you hold it down, remember you do use the next one. We've also got Rending Gale and Severing Winds. The Higher Art of Rending Gale. Oh, so this is good as well. So we actually have two that we could use. Oh, Rending Gale we actually have on already. I wonder if it'll be worth putting civet. Uh, yeah. Let's put it straight on. And then if worse comes to worse, we can always change it up. I actually don't know if Saray has... Oh, he has Frigid Moon. Okay, that's no good. Frigid Moon is clearly a water type. Yes. He actually doesn't have any... Sword Raid is a water type as well? What? Are you serious? How? In what way is Sword Raid... Okay. Oh, I guess it has rain in the word. Are you freaking serious? It doesn't look like that at all, but okay. It's the only wind one we have, the wolf wind. It actually is. Well, I guess we're going to be relying on the the other hype, the martial arts. No, which one of these? Hidden arts. We'll be relying on hidden arts. Cantering wind and the revolt and raging winds, I guess. I really like cantering flames. It's one of my favorites. It may be worth putting. In fact, let's put crimson edge on there and put raging winds on there. Okay, that will do me. All right, you. Oh my word, he is a it chicken. Off again. We have to get close to it without being seen. Maybe it's trying to corner us so it can trap us with its I don't know, giant bull. That is not what I meant to do. Alright, let's see this new move. Oh, it's not new at all. How about this rages? Alright, that's boring. I was hoping it would be something exciting and new. But no. It isn't. It totally isn't. It's the same thing as always. There is a scorpion there. We don't like scorpions, so let's not go fight. Ooh, a treasure room! I do like treasure. There is a scorpion, though, but the scorpion is blind as a bat. I don't know. That may actually be very true for scorpions in reality. I'm not sure. All right, scorpion. Let's see what you're made of. It's a one-eyed cyclops scorpion. And there's a lot of them. This definitely looks dangerous. You better watch out for its tail movements and attacks. They sometimes go underground. Stay calm and handle it. Sweet. What does that mean? Stay calm and handle it. I'm not gonna tell you how. Just, just do handle it, you know? Luckily, they're not that strong and they die pretty quickly. I feel like we're actually starting to get strong now, which is good. It's, it's about damn time we started getting strong. Um, let us eat. Oh, we actually don't have it. Yeah, we must do. We always have them. Oh, they're here. Okay. So we got these things. Should I stick them all in? I think we should stick them in someone else now. So let's stick them all in Rose, since Rose has to be in every battle. It kind of seems pointless putting anyone else's stats up other than Saray and Rose, because they're forced into every battle by the fact that they're the only humans in the party. Which does seem a bit odd. I don't know. In a sense, it's kind of... It doesn't give you the freedom to change your team up, but... Oh, what? What? I think just died. This one's not so weak. I don't know why that one was so weak. Did they like? Did they like a special way of killing them instantly or something? That's so weird. Anyhow, we, we took him out. Oh, we did fifty thousand damage. We did fifty-five thousand damage in one hit. That's why. How did that even happen? Is that like a random event? Like, can you do critical damage and just destroy something? That was weird. I don't know. Maybe I'm really not paying attention to this game at all. I just don't understand what's going on. But that's probably it. Oh, yeah, yeah, that did do a lot, actually. Holy moly, yeah. Yeah, 
Yeah, these golem guys don't get to do anything. So, how's Saray doing? He's yet inexperienced, but he's got potential. You're quite critical of him. He just doesn't respond to my jokes like you do. Why Didn't do they need a shepherd aptitude? Why do they only give you 44 experience? That's like nothing. Is that why it's so easy? Was I meant to come here earlier or something? Maybe I was meant to come sure here before the water temple. Because they were super tanky, weren't they? They weren't tough though. I don't know. But the equipment. Ah, I'm so confused. Alright, punch this away. Pow! That's right, this ancient temple. Let's beat it up. That makes so much sense. This is clearly gonna kill someone. This is not a good idea at all. Alright, crush the crush the pillars. What, what exactly did that do? Right, well, okay, let's go find out then by running around. Not, I, I assume that would actually do something, like it will make something happen. Oh, I guess we lowered the floor above us. I forgot we went down the stairs. I mean, it obviously lowered the floor above us because we punched away the pillars, but it must have lowered the floor in a way that helps us somehow. Although, forgive me if I don't see it immediately, because I don't see it immediately. All right, let's take care of this slime, man. I have a feeling that uh, we actually, yeah. Uh, wait, what level are these enemies? Yeah, these enemies are actually lower level than us, which is pretty much the first time that's happened. Yeah, I have a feeling that because you can do either this temple or the water temple kind of whenever, I don't think it's particularly dictated to you. Although, although it was suggesting we did the water temple, wasn't it? I don't know. But I have a feeling that because you can do either at any point, they're both similar kind of difficulty, and hence why we feel really strong now, and we didn't fit, we felt like they were pretty damn tanky and everyone. Having said that, Ashura is pretty easy to take out, so... What do I know? A Felspar Umbrella, that sounds quite good. Would you like to use that, uh, Madame Edna? Would this, would this Felspar... It would. Oh, except we want magic damage on Edna, really, don't we? So let's just leave her what, what she's got for now. We'll work out all the equipment stuff afterwards. It doesn't make... Well, it does make a big difference, but at the same time, it, it's not so huge that it's worth worrying about too much. You are a terrifying fairy. Okay. Don't be fooled by their looks. The powerful spellcasters. Trust me, I know the small ones are the most trouble. Why is that? Cause you're small, dude. No, don't be so hard on yourself. Ow! That's not a spell cast. It's just whacking me with your wings and apparently doing a gazillion damage, which is the correct. I honestly like the fire combo the best, mainly because I just use it all the time. But it honestly, it just seems, it doesn't really fit together all that well. But he, it's, it's got a lot of hits in it and it looks cool. There's a lot of explosions and fire and it's awesome. There needs to be an electric type. They ought to add that in. I love to use electricity. Electricity is just fun. Electricity and fire. Oof. Beautiful. Beautiful. Anyway. Oh, that's a slime. I thought that was a chest. Whoops. I want to run towards that, really. Let's grab the stat increase. Gives you HP and SC. That's pretty good. SC being the the stuff you use to use, use attacks. So, kind of useful in many, many ways. All right, we'll grab this chest. The fairy may try and take us down. I have no idea. Is this pot chair? It's a broken chair. Oh, it's a horse. Found a discovery point. Broken hobby horse. Great. What are you going to say about it? I used to have Oops, one of those. I'm just hallucinating a wooden horse in the middle of the shrine. Don't mind me. It's awful tiny. You think it's for kids, maybe? Toy horses are only rarely made for adults, so yes. But what's a toy doing here inside the Shrine of Trials? How would I know? Seems unlikely it's related to the trial. It just bugs me. Maybe it's some kind of hint. Um, toy horse, horses, horse and buggy. Carrots, horse meat, horse burgers, horse waffles, horse cream cones. Crap. Now I'm hungry and yucked out. The dread overthinking a non sequitur trap of the ancients. Tremble before their mastery of psychological torture. Edna's awesome. I like Edna. She's a cool character. Anyhow, the fairy's coming to get me, apparently. Bring it on, fairy. Oh, there is, there's the guy. All right, let's take out both of them at once. Bring it on, fairy man. Actually, this could be really bad, because they use magic, and I'm really bad at stopping magic. Because apparently there isn't a setting to tell the computer to do it for me. Wait, you're... Oh, I thought you were weak to... I thought you were weak to that. Well, I guess not. I always thought they were weak to win. No. Oh, 
Yeah, let's take him all down. Yeah, we need to take out one fairy, so I, they can't ever use spells on us, right? Okay, well... Oh, we got it! Right at the end. Right at the last. That actual... That lion's... Whatever it's called. Lion's roar. I'm gonna call it Beast, because that's what it's called in Symphonia. Although it's not entirely the same. It's pretty much the same spell. Yeah. Can we stop them using those spells? Yeah, just don't let them use those spells, team. And we'll be fine. That's literally all we have to do. Oh my word, there's so many of them. So I have to fight two at once. Ow. Oh, Frigid Moon's cool, actually. Let's do that one again. I not Freezing Frost. Say Frigid Moon, it's a much cooler nerve. Frigid Frost or Freezing. What did he say? I can't remember. It was so lame that I don't remember anymore. Alright, there's the dog man. He's not a dog, he's a boar. He's a boar hound. Wait, if we don't go there straight away, is there another way of going to him? Can we, like, sneak up on him? Oh, I found a chest! Cowboy hat! Oh, yeah! Now he can pretend to cosplay Dezel! Woo! That's exactly what I wanted to do all the time! Maybe not, but, you know. Useful in some ways, maybe? Probably not, but there you go. It looks like we actually have to go in here and scare him away again, so... Yo, dude! Maybe we walk really slowly, you won't see us. I'm not behind you! Totally not behind you! Actually, is this working? No, it's not working, alright. Dang, there it goes again! Pretty fast for a thick slab of beef. Alright, don't be cruel. Hmm? He actually, like, considering he's such a scaredy cat, it's not exactly destructive. Don't he's not doing jealous. anything bad, we just decided we want to kill him. Because we're horrible people. I'm just going to point that out. That is actually the truth. Yeah, he's literally done nothing wrong. We, just, we literally invaded his home and decided to kill him. So, who's the monster here exactly? Alright, we got him. It's a level up as well. Why is that chest glowing? It's like, Bee! Oh, it's maybe it's the Mormon. Yeah, it's the... Not the Mormon, the Norman! They are not Mormons! I'm sure that's really offensive to you Mormons out there, but, you know. You know. <laughs> I'm not trying to offend you. Just very... Just, you know, it's one letter difference. It's not my fault. Alright, let's not kill this, this scorpion. I see BA. Can we punch this thing away? Oh, yeah. Oh, this might be the beginning. Yeah, it's the beginning again. Alright, excellent. So now we can go back and forth through there. And get things done. You know what? I do question how exactly the door is... The door is blocked, considering, you know... Oh, there we go. Well, uh, why is the door blocked? Because the doors open sideways in into themselves. And... Yeah. If it's a rock standing on the other side, then I'd understand if the door pushed open, but it, it doesn't. So, makes no sense. Why do you need assistance? Well, like... Destroying them. It's not even not even a challenge really. Alright, we have to go in here. Alright, fairy. Actually, I'll tell you what, there's no sorcerer's ring in this game. Ain't that weird? Or was there a sorcerer's ring? I mean we could do this. This is basically a sorcerer's ring, let's be honest. Time to punch some more pillars and make the floor fall down. And so they make the floor fall. Destroying all in their path. As they punch things mercy. You know, this is real dangerous. I, I, I would not suggest doing this in real life. Not that you could punch a brick wall and make it collapse completely, but you know, even if you could, I'm pretty sure punching things and making pillars fall down in ancient ruins is a horrible, horrible idea. Just gonna put that out there. Wait, what? Oh my word, stop. Stop it, will you? We're gonna hit him with Frigid Moon as well. Haste makes waste. Haste makes waste. That is, I don't know, that's a saying. I'm not sure how true it is, but there you go. It depends how skillful you are at haste, maybe. 
How do we miss this chest? We decided to go for the camp meal instead. There you go. Soft serve ice. Okay, so nothing particularly exciting there, but hey, food is food. It may be worth eating some food, actually, because we, we seem to just acquire a ton of it and never really use it. So I wonder. You could eat a pound cake. Pound cake! For all your pounding needs. It also gives you earth resistance, which is pretty good in an earth temple where everything is earth. Literally everything. Alright. Stay away from me, fairy. I don't want to fight you. I don't want to kill you, fairy! I totally do want to kill him, though. Alrighty. Oh, we actually opened the door. That's what we were doing. Alright. But I want these arcane bottles and this guy. He's Fatty G! Got the equipment of open skills! I hope so. What do you give me? Fatigue capability plus 10%. That sounds terrible. Go on this instead. Alright. Cheers, buddy. Thanks for joining us. So you weren't as great as I thought you could be, but thanks anyway. Oh, I'm so mean. He did okay. He did his best. He's a fatty and he's a G. I mean, he's so G, man. So G. Oh, chest room. We do like ourselves chest rooms. Especially when they're guarded by weak-ass scorpions. Cyclops scorpions, may I add. Wait, where did that fairy go? It's there. Alright, bring it on. We'll take the profile. out. Oh, God. Wait, what? Scorpions, please. Oh, no. Got him. Alright, I'm gonna take out the fairy. You guys do your stuff. Now, don't use Kadri's place. I am. Why are you. Why is this person right in the corner of the other room? Why is this part of the field? I actually can't get back, can I? Saray, please! Saray, go, go, Saray! Yes! We made it! We actually made it. Alright. Crazy stuff. Why is that part of the battlefield? I don't know, but there you go. That is. I, know, I haven't talked about it before, but I really like that part of the battle system. The fact that you can. You, you literally battle where you're standing. It's really cool. That's like the best part about the battle system in this game. The rest of it is kind of meh. Especially since you're forced to use Saray and Rosie Rose, but otherwise, yeah, not bad. Not bad at all. Anyhow, this is the room where we... Oh, I'm so disorientated now. Okay, so we just went in there for the chest. We came from there, so this way it must be, I think. If I am not so mistaken. What is that giant door there? That looks rather ominous. Let's open this one. No, we can't. Okay, I guess that may be where the temple shrine, whatever it's called, is. And we'll have to go there some other time. What about up here? Hmm. But I want to check all the doorways. Damn it, game. You can't do this to me. So where does this one go? Is this back where we've been? I can't tell. How am I going to tell? No, this is so unfair. Oh, wait. This goes downstairs. Okay, so maybe there's more bits to punch. Oh. But I can't punch that because it hasn't fallen down yet. Okay. The magic is... By magic, it is floating. And there's nothing I can do about that. How? Like, what? What are you even making that float? Uh, I don't know why it's floating, but yeah, we can't punch that yet. Unless we can aim upwards suddenly, but I don't think we can. I'm pretty sure Saray only punches in a straight line because, you know, he has no uppercut abilities, unfortunately. Oh, this guy changed... The fairy changed into a rock golem. Maybe that's how it works. I was not not informed of this, but maybe. Uh, oh, actually, there's two doorways here. Uh, one leads downwards. I am. I can't even remember where we've been, where we haven't been. Pretty sure we haven't been in here though. Should lead downstairs. Now, whether we can actually punch anything is probably identical to the one across. Oh no, we can punch something. All right then. All right then. Oh, and there's one of these. Let's see what this has to say. Probably nothing interesting, but we can read it. It appears to be written in ancient dog. Mystic Arts. There are a number of methods for reducing... Oh, really? Blast Guard's consumption when using Mystic Arts. One way is through battle actions. There are a few to choose from that take effect when you meet various criteria, like number of hits or cumulative damage infliction, meaning that fighting with a bit of flair can actually be to your advantage. Oh, that would be quite useful, actually. I don't think we have any. I checked the battle actions reasonably recently. Unless that unlocks them, I don't think we actually have any. Now, does that move the one on the other side so we can now punch it, perhaps? 
Do we want to check? Well, I guess we may as well. It's only a quick run across the hallway. If only Saray could run a little bit quicker, that would be grand, but unfortunately not. We also haven't checked up that stairway, which I imagine we need to do, but we'll do that when it comes. The time will come, I'm sure. We don't need to do anything special until then anyway. So let's head down here. What do you see? Oh yes, it has moved. Oh my word, am I really going to have to run back and forth the whole time? Is that really a thing? Bam! Alright, let's run down the other way. <laughs> so I don't know if that's actually unlocked anything or done anything in particular. Hopefully it hasn't meant we missed a chest. That would be the worst. I do like chests. I like I like treasure. I, well, honestly... Oh, this opened. Ah, okay. But there was something to punch on the other side. So what would that be? Hmm. Now if this closes the door again, I'm going to be real sad. Let's be like, oh no, we need to build the rocks back in. Okay, no, it doesn't, it didn't do anything. Alright, cool. So it wasn't a back and forth game, it was my fault. So let's check up the stairs. We'll go to the save point quickly. We'll save it down, just in case we get killed by anything. I don't know how that would happen, but wouldn't put it past me. I've died many, many a time. So we'll run to this, we'll save it quickly. Oh, we've got to chase the bull into here first, don't we? Which we haven't done, I imagine. Well, they have something to say. It looked terrifying, but I've never seen a hellion so timid. That's to be expected. The Minotauros is a manifestation of the collective emotions of those who have been tortured and abused. This accounts for the anger it displays in all situations. So, like, it rages at people to avoid the feeling of being raged at? A case of misplaced anger, huh? Wouldn't kill it to do a little reflection. No, no, it wouldn't. All right, ignore the scorpion and run up here. So we're gonna have to chase the scorp the Minotaurus down those steps, and then it will be trapped. And we will kick its ass. So I imagine we have to chase it from across here. Because that would make the most sense to me anyway. Move out the way. Yeah. That's what I thought. Oh no, this is the beginning. I don't want to jump down. Alright. Okay, never mind then. Maybe maybe the Minotaur is already down there. When confirming a target, pay attention to its category. For example, the category group skill and a melee can both damage... Increase damage to and reduce damage from beast type enemies. Adjusting your equipment to correspond to enemy categories shall advance mastery of skills. Yeah, but that's a freaking pain in the ass. Why would anyone do that? I don't want to go to the, the equipment selection every every battle and change my equipment up. That's a real pain. I'm not doing that. Get out of here. Get out of town. Alright, well, I guess the Minotaurus is trapped down here, so we're going straight down here. I mean, it, it makes sense for battles, I guess, changing your equipment. Boss battles, I say. Like that serpent lady, maybe I should change my equipment to be good against serpents? That might help. But anyhow, wait, this is the Minotaurus isn't even here. Uh oh. Well, that's that, I guess. So where is he? What? What? Where did he even run off to? Oh, he must be back at the beginning then, because we've checked... We have checked everywhere, right? Ah, hang on. No. Yeah, we totally checked everywhere. I think. God damn, I don't know. I don't know where we've been and where we haven't been. Let's just check down these stairs again quickly. Just make sure we actually got everything down here. So I'm pretty sure I ran down here, punched something, and then ran off again. Yeah, we totally got everything. Okay. Huh. But you're meant to be able to go through here. So how do we do that? Did I kind of screw up? I may have done. There's a save point through. Oh, no, wait, what? Hey, mightily confused right now. Okay, let's go back to the beginning. Maybe the Minotaur runs around in a circle. We just need to chase it back through and get it down those steps. Maybe that's how it works. That's the only way I can see it. So maybe it's gone back to where we first saw it. Just past the entrance way. And then it will go back to where it was where we saw it the second time, and then this time, instead of running all the way around because the door was closed, it will run down to the altar and we can capture it in our Pokeballs. Hang on, wrong game. But you know what I mean. Pretty much what we're gonna do. It's very similar to said Pokemon game. Most Pokemon games. So you're in him and yeah, he is. Alright, so that's what he does. You must run around in the circuit like that. So yeah, run away from me, Bolly. It's extremely wary of us. This is bullcrap. Edna. Wow. 
Wow. I wasn't really expecting the game to do. Yeah, how did it get here? It went around completely the opposite direction, but there you go. Luckily, we know where it's going, so we're going to run it straight down into the altar room. Yo, bull. This sure isn't going Oh, it just well. runs literally the opposite direction to you. If we don't find some other way. Yeah, we found another way, I think. I think. I hope. I pray. Not down that way, though. Not that way, either. Which way is it? I can't remember the direction. Ah... Uh, is it through there? I think it must be. Yeah, it must be. We must have punched the pillars in this room and knocked this down. Yeah, that makes sense. I'm hoping now we knocked it down to the altar. That's what I'm hoping. Now, whether that's actually the case, we're about to find out. Fingers crossed, right, people? Fingers crossed. Come on, oh, come on, man. Oh, it doesn't look like he's down there. All right, maybe we screwed up again. What? Maybe there's something else I need to do then. Yeah, he's not here, is he? Hmm. But it's not like you could change where he runs off to, can you? Right. In that case, can we shut off the doors? Is that a, is there a way to shut the doors down? So he has to run this way? Because basically, you want to trap him so he runs into here. Which means there must be something else you can punch, because I can't imagine there's any other way of doing it. Hmm. Peculiar, indeed. Uh, maybe if I run around the other way, maybe that will get him? I don't know. Let's try that, I guess. From this side? Or if I go around the other way? So if I go through that door and backtrack through and go back behind him, maybe he runs a different way? One can hope. Oh, one can hope, indeed. So we're going to run around behind him, and we're going to pray that that uh, scares him out of his wits so much that he runs into a dead end. Fingers crossed. I'm pretty convinced that he has to run into the... that it, it must, by all intents and purposes. He must run into the, the altar room to fight him. Alright, nothing hey, special happened. What if we use my spectral cloak? Oh, okay, that makes that sense. It, you're going to take my Earth trial away from me? You're welcome to find some other way, if it's not too much of a hassle for you. <sighs> Alright, we'll try that then. That actually makes a lot of sense, I probably should have seen that coming. Okay. No, no, no! Ooh! Actually, I don't know which one it is. Alright, let's see if he can see us through this. Maybe he can smell us. Oh, it worked. Okay, cool. <laughs> Thanks for telling me, Mebo. It's giving up on running. Looks like it means business. Be on your guard, everyone. What's he doing? What was that? It sounded like kids crying. Ow, did you see the body slam? Alright, try to get healed, I guess. Stop crying, kiddies, we don't care. I'm a, I'm a dickhead that doesn't care. I couldn't work out how to get to the stupid Minotaur, because honestly, the stupid, like, hiding, like, a spectral cloak thing is dumb. Wow, this thing is super weak, man. Then we can finish it off, shall we? Oh, we got. Oh, well, we didn't get it. What? How did I not get it? Wait, are we not hurting it anymore? I understand how we didn't get it with the Mister Guard. I guess our Mister Guard did a lot less damage than I thought it would. Oh, we got it that time. Did we truly save him? No, we literally slew him. Sorry for scaring you. Goodbye. Rest in peace. Edna. Wait, did the spirits of the children turn to Seraphim? Dunno. Let's move on to the altar. Pawan is waiting for us. Yeah. Roger. Oh, that was... is unforgivable. 
I finally understand. Oh, Edna. Even if it's a pain, I'll never take the easy way out again. Though it totally is a pain. <laughs> That's the Edna I know. Hey. Well, that was sus suspiciously easy again. Why is the Minotaur so weak? I don't know. Anyhow, we'll run back up to the altar. We won't go there yet, though. I think we'll do that next time. Thank you very much for joining me on this one. Hope you do join me again. I imagine there will be another boss since Pavwan, or whatever his name is, surely has something else in store, right? Thank you very much for joining me on this one. I hope you do join me again tomorrow. This guy is coming ever closer, so we're going to call it quick. Ah! Thank you very much for joining me. Until next time, good night.